Look up, on a clear day you see the sun, our star, the engine of our world. Every plant, animal and person owes their existence to its light and warmth, traveling 150 million kilometers to reach us. Without the sun, Earth would be a frozen, lifeless rock. We set our clocks and calendars by its steady rhythm, often taking it for granted. But nothing in the universe is truly constant, not even the sun. It was born, it is living and one day, it will die. Scientists have discovered the sun is gradually getting hotter, a process unfolding over millions and billions of years. This isn't about today's climate change, but the grand story of a star's life. The sun's increasing temperature is a natural part of its evolution, a consequence of the physics that makes it shine. These changes won't affect us tomorrow but understanding them gives us perspective on our place in the universe. Should we be alarmed? The answer is complex. In the short term, the sun presents challenges like solar storms. In the very long term, its rising temperature poses an existential threat to Earth. By exploring the science behind our star's evolution, we can appreciate the stability we enjoy now. We can also contemplate the incredible future that awaits humanity as we navigate our relationship with our magnificent, changing sun. The sun's story is our story, one of change, challenge, and cosmic wonder. Let's begin. To understand why the sun is getting hotter, we need to know what it is. The sun isn't a ball of fire, it's a star, a gigantic sphere of hot gas, mostly hydrogen and helium. At its core, temperatures reach 15 million degrees Celsius and pressures are unimaginable. Here nuclear fusion occurs, hydrogen atoms fuse to form helium, releasing energy. This process transforms mass into energy, as described by Einstein's e clutch MC2. The energy created in the core begins a long journey outward, bouncing from atom to atom for over 100,000 years. The light that warms your face today was born before human civilization began. By the time it reaches the sun's surface it's cooled to about 5,500 degrees Celsius. The sun is a self-regulating nuclear furnace, balanced between the outward push of fusion and the inward pull of gravity. This balance, hydrostatic equilibrium, has kept the sun stable for billions of years. It's this steady stream of energy that made life on Earth possible. But this balance is not permanent. The sun's core is slowly changing, setting the stage for its future evolution. Understanding this nuclear engine is key to understanding our star's fate. The sun's power is awe-inspiring, and it's only the beginning of its story. Our star's journey is far from over. Let's see what happens next. The sun is a middle-aged star about 4.6 billion years old in its stable main sequence phase. It steadily fuses hydrogen into helium in its core, but this process is slowly changing its internal structure. As hydrogen turns to helium, the core becomes denser and hotter. A hotter core speeds up fusion, making the sun burn more fiercely. This extra energy causes the sun to expand slightly and grow brighter. The change is slow, about 1% brighter every 100 million years. Since its birth the sun has become 30% more luminous. This is a natural part of stellar evolution for stars like ours. All stars go through this process, born shining and slowly getting hotter and brighter. For the next 5 billion years the sun will continue this way, growing ever brighter. Eventually its hydrogen will run out, and it will transform into a red giant. But for now the slow warming is just the first step on a long journey. The sun's evolution is inevitable, and it shapes the fate of our planet. The sun's gradual brightening has profound consequences for Earth's future. As the sun gets brighter more energy reaches Earth, slowly warming our climate. Over hundreds of millions of years, this extra energy will disrupt the balance that keeps our oceans liquid and temperatures suitable for life. More water will evaporate, increasing water vapor, a powerful greenhouse gas. This triggers a feedback loop, more heat, more evaporation and even more heat. Eventually, Earth's atmosphere will become thick with water vapor, and temperatures will soar. In about a billion years, the sun will be 10% brighter, enough to trigger a runaway greenhouse effect. The oceans will boil away, and Earth will become a hot, dry, sterile world. Long before the sun becomes a red giant, its increasing brightness will make Earth uninhabitable. The habitable zone will move outward, leaving our planet behind. This distant future reminds us how fragile our world is. Life's window on Earth is finite dictated by the sun's unstoppable evolution. While the sun's long-term evolution is predictable, its short-term behavior is dynamic and complex. The sun has its own cycles, most notably the 11-year solar cycle of magnetic activity. At solar maximum, sunspots and solar storms are more frequent, 
At minimum the sun is quieter. The sun's magnetic fields twist and tangle, sometimes snapping and releasing bursts of energy. Occasionally the solar cycle nearly shuts down, as during the Maunder Minimum, which coincided with the Little Ice Age. The sun can surprise us. Other stars like ours have produced super flares far more powerful than anything we've seen. While our sun is relatively stable we can't rule out extreme events. Understanding these cycles is crucial for protecting our technology and infrastructure. The sun's short-term moods can have real consequences for our modern world. We must stay vigilant, watching for the sun's next surprise. Our star is both reliable and unpredictable. The sun's short-term activity poses real dangers to our technology. Solar flares and coronal mass ejections CMEs, send bursts of radiation and plasma into space. Earth's magnetic field shields us, but powerful storms can overwhelm our defenses. These storms can induce currents in power grids, causing blackouts and damaging transformers. The Carrington event of 1859 caused telegraph failures and auroras as far south as the Caribbean. If a similar event happened today, the damage to our power and communication systems would be catastrophic. Our society is deeply reliant on electricity. Solar storms are a low-probability high-impact threat. Scientists and governments are working to prepare for such events. The sun's storms remind us how vulnerable our modern world can be. The sun's eventual sterilization of Earth is billions of years away, but it inspires bold ideas. One proposal, build a giant solar shield or a swarm of shades at the L1 Lagrange point to block some sunlight. Another gradually move Earth's orbit outward using gravitational assists from asteroids or comets. The engineering challenges are immense but not impossible in theory. Ultimately, humanity's best hope may be to become a multi-planetary species. Colonizing other worlds or building space habitats could ensure our survival beyond Earth. The sun's future pushes us to dream big and plan for the far future. To understand and prepare for the sun's changes, scientists constantly monitor it. Spacecraft like NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory and the Parker Solar Probe study the sun in detail. These missions observe sunspots, flares, and CMEs in real time collecting crucial data. This information helps us predict space weather and protect satellites, power grids, and airlines. Constant monitoring is essential for our technological society. Studying the sun also refines our understanding of stellar evolution. Every observation adds to the story of our star's life. Our eyes in the sky help us prepare for both the sun's surprises and its long-term changes. Should we be alarmed by the sun's rising temperature? For us, the answer is no. The sun's changes are unfolding on timescales far beyond our daily lives. Our immediate climate challenges are of our own making. The sun's gradual warming is a distant concern, but it gives us perspective. It reminds us that our world is a temporary gift of cosmic circumstance. The sun's story inspires wonder, reflection, and scientific progress. Solar storms push us to build resilient infrastructure. The distant future encourages us to dream beyond Earth. These challenges unite us as a species, facing a shared cosmic destiny. We are not just passengers on spaceship Earth, we are its navigators, charting a course into the deep future. The sun's journey is our journey and the story continues.